uh, meeting Rowan coming up against El Shabini. She's been thwarted and, and she she should be higher. She's such a, a like beautifully compact player. So she's been kind of held at bay from her current Three, potential. Two. Too accurate, too clever. Eight, four. She's looking confident out there, the Welsh number one. Big, big day on Squash TV. Video referee review, please. Again, it's a risky shot going cross court from there. I thought she would have been better off playing the fourth, uh, backhand straight body drop yep. there. Mid court. Sits up, doesn't it? Well, the no well I did in. agree. I didn't think that was. Uh, I didn't think it was a winner personally, but. 11 6, game to Evans. Evans leads one game to Tesney Tesney Evans straight off court. She brought her A game to this, Tesney Evans. It's extraordinary. Um, Explanation that actually there's not much that takes Tesney Evans by surprise, <laughs> but that did. Thanks. It's good. 2 1. That follow through, really directing that volley drop very almost. Victor can get into a mix of elongating the court and stretching Evans. Oh. Oh, so smart. Very, very. So good. Thank you. Eight. For Tesney Evans and des deservedly so. There, she's Eleven taking seven, it. Match Evans, two games to love. Hugely Eleven natural six, squash seven. player, Tesney Evans. Holding off Olivia Victor, who is certainly one of the danger players coming through. But look at that, 21 minutes, a bit of a masterclass from Evans. Well, we're happy you're back. Um, tell us about playing Olivia, one of America's young stars. Um, you guys had some great points, but what did you think? Yeah, I mean, we, we haven't actually played that much at all. I think we've only played once and she beat me, so I remember that day <laughs> a lot. <laughs> uh, it's haunted me, you know. It's, she'd only just started on the tour and uh, she, yeah, she completely blitzed me off the court. So I, I was, you know, up for today. Um, she's a great, great player, I think. You know, you can see each tournament and stuff. Her results don't lie, her ranking doesn't lie, and it won't be long before she's, you know up even higher than she already is. So, you know, it's, I had to come out and play, play my best. Four, three. It's trading, trading quick points here. Neither is quite settled. It's very bitty. It's very bitty thus far, but this is a very key moment in games where one may tend to break away. Six, we'll see what Whitlock five. does, but to get ball. the ball a bit deeper in the court. And if you're not, then you have to take advantage of your opponent's shortcomings. Oh, that's a tidy little shot. Nine, eight. Yeah, it was clever. She's very good at that. Coming in, she went in two-footed, improvised with the wrist. Out. 11-8, game to Chinapa. Chinapa leads, one game to love. The world number 11, Joshna Chinapa. Not panicking, any shape or form, confident in her attacking ability. Short, sharp rallies playing into the hands 
the number seven seed. Leading though by one game to love. Handout five six. Good stretch across the midcourt here from Whitlock. She does that very well. I was teed up for her, but she does it well. She late kills five. backhand or forehand cross court. She's done it. So Chinapa. Eleven five. Match to Chinapa. Two games to love. Conditions, eight, but also five. the best of three format suits her game. She looks pretty up for this out in San Francisco. Just 19 minutes, so very quick fire. Josh, first of all, congratulations. Well done. Um, it's always nice, I think, to get through a first round, especially in a three-game match to love. How did you feel out there? I felt like I had a little bit of a shaky start, uh, but uh, you know it's just about getting used to the court and uh, really trying to uh, find your length. And I thought I managed to do that uh, for the most part uh, of the match. And yeah, I'm just so happy to be through <laughs> against a very tough opponent. This is unbelievable from Sobe already. Yeah. For love. Well, I mean, the, one of the gate, the black ball open, Joey, was 11, 5, 3, and 1. So. It's commentating on that one. We were. Strangely. So it. Uh, 5 love. Three, Nothing wrong ball. with that. Not at all. Amanda Sobe taking no prisoners out there. Down. Yeah, Eleven, that three, area of the court Sobe. proving Sobe so effective. One game to love. Outright winners for Sobe to the back of the court on the left hand wall. Beautifully well, feathered in. Sobe just walking off. Watch this. She just yes. plays the shot and then she's like, right, you're going to get that squash ball. In the One, realms seven. of as role models, you want to see them still fight till the bitter end. Well, That's why they train. Player that was uh, from back in the day that was a, a savage fighter. Eight out. Eight one. Australian sadly playing in this uh, men's no, and women's been... event. But Ricky Hill's watching all the way back in Ireland. Wish you and Deb's the best, and I hope you're enjoying the squash, Ricky. Ashling also sends her best. She I do, do indeed. It. You can say it yourself. Stop it. Nine, um, one. Ricky knows that I'll... 14. Very quick ball. fire, best of three. Look at that. 11-4, match to Sobe, two games to love. Well, that's the way you deal with uh, world number 14. 11-3, 11-4. So the festivities go on here, but it's good to see that local USA player, the number one player on the PSA World Tour, the men and the women representing USA, Amanda Sobe. It's a great shot. Oh, 
Oh, my goodness <laughs> me, that's an outrageous shot. Oh. oh, that was unbelievable. Talk about open racket face and technique. Really Check this that. out. Wow. Just lost the ball in two. Great shot. That's where she's good. Yeah, it's a lovely shot. Hand out, fire she does that like ball. the ball off the bounce there in that area. Cuts it in so well. Oh, that was a gift. 11-5. Yeah, a couple Game of errors creeping Perry in there. Leads, one game to love. Just see her whacking her leg. She's furious with herself, and it's hard to know if she's 100% fit. <laughs> she's creating some slice on that ball tonight, Joey. Yeah, she's really oh, cutting through. I hear that. So Just open. that extra sound. <laughs> wow. There's the first outward emotion we've heard from Sarah and J. Out, Perry. Seven, six. It's a great shot, though. Volleys yeah. indeed. 9 8. Edging it here. Good fight back. That ripper of a no, boat saving the day once again. She's done it, so Sarah J. Perry holds off Rowan El Arabi. 11-5, Some very entertaining and feisty squash in the last match of today's play. Sarah J. Perry overcoming Rowan El Arabi, the 21-year-old from Cairo, by two games to love. Yeah, I absolutely love it here. Uh, great to see so many people uh, in the crowds on this cold night, but fantastic. Uh, so thank you very much. Uh, you know, I, have, I do have a, a really good record here. Um, I, I love playing on this court. And after my solo practice the other day, the day I got here, I, I went and found John Nimick and I said, oh, John, thank you. It's a pleasure to play on this court. <laughs> um, and that was just doing 20 minutes of solo practice. So. Uh, I was super, super excited to actually get on here and play a match. Um, I think the first game showed my experience on this court. And then uh, I think, uh, you know, Rowan really got herself going in that second. So I was pleased to nip it in the end because I thought my level dropped a bit. But, you know, she was playing better. So it's a bit of, bit of both, I think.